Boris Johnson has handed French President Emmanuel Macron free reign over UK waters, a pro-Brexit campaigner has claimed, after data indicated no EU boats have been denied access to British waters. Jane Ardia was speaking at a time of raised tensions between the two countries in the wake of threats by Annick Girardin, France's Minister for the Sea, to cut off Jersey's electricity supply earlier this month, coupled with threats by French fishing boats to blockade the island. Mr. Johnson responded by deploying two Royal Navy boats to disperse the French vessels, but Ms. Ardia, director of campaign group Get Britain Out, said the incident should not be allowed to obscure the wider issue. Specifically, Ms. Ardia pointed to two freedom of information requests which she had submitted to DEFRA. These revealed that 1,659 boats have been granted licenses to fish in the UK's exclusive economic zone, including eight super trawlers, while 105 vessels have also been granted licenses to fish inside the nation's 6 to 12 nautical mile range, with not a single application rejected. Ms. Ardia said, just last week, Emmanuel Macron again threatened to block a deal on financial services if fishing disputes are not resolved, quite frankly how much more does he want, because as far as I can see, French fishermen seem to have everything they asked for already. The reality is the EU, and in particular the French, seem to believe they should be given free reign over another country's land and sea, and unfortunately the current UK-EU trade and cooperation agreement all but confirms this. Addressing the response of the Prime Minister himself, he added, it is about time Prime Minister Boris Johnson gets his act together and actually addresses these issues. The local elections are now behind him and the pandemic appears to be coming to an end. There is no time for more excuses. There's still a great deal to do to finish Brexit for the good of global Britain Boris.